So, hey guys, um, I updated my hideout, my Orvis Little Cliff hideout, quite some, quite some bit. So this is a major release now. This will be version one point uh, This will probably still get some slightly change, slight changes because uh, I'm, I'm not a hundred percent confident with this. Um, if you if you if you know the last video and the last version, um, from what you can see here, what changed is that I reversed uh, the side of the work working station, so to say. We just stashed the seed stock pile on the guild stash and the crafting bench, uh, just because if you if you open maps here, you tend to uh, spawn below the map device, and here are a lot of trees, and it was kind of yeah. It, it was was not feeling good to to actually select something over here so now everything is here clean sleep uh, at the at this the, on, at those tracks at this way here uh, you can click all of them uh, the first trader is up here it's Navali uh, just also for divination card trading and stuff like that um, so I yeah I will come to the left part here later because there will be a lot of changes. The the temple is basically the same. It's just that this this roof is now more complete. It's still not all the way there because it costs a lot of favor to do that. Um, what I what I what the, the big change here is is what I did with uh, with the bridge. So before it was just this clean bridge, and now. I put some decorations here. So first of all, what I wanted to achieve was some kind of river or a lake, which is below, which seems to be below uh, the bridge. For that, I used mountain springs, but they are elevated here. So I also had to change the bridge and put a lot of wooden beams here, just because they add some height and just partially occlude this this stuff that's going on because of the of the mountain springs. The idea with this whole hideout is that it's kind of overgrown and that the uh, vegetation erupts out of the stone and I wanted to add some, some mystic elements, that's why I put the temple there. And also recently I leveled up Alva and got the Colossus head and I always loved those uh, those Colossus uh, decorations actually. And I tried to to build something with it. Um, so my idea, it's I, I tested this with some people, and it's not apparent at the first moment what's happening here, but you can see probably the Colossus head here. My idea was that at some point in time, this this giant huge Colossus fell asleep here and kind of became stone, became became the uh, the rock that this build out, uh, this hideout is is built from. So, uh, what you can see here is the head. I put another Colossus leg over here so that it, that it looks like a bit like a shoulder. And this arm will go down here. Here's another hand, you can see. The other arm is here. So, that Colossus is kind of laying on his arm, then embracing this, this rock. And here is his left hand. You can also see it from from the cliff here a little bit that the the arm is really going around this this rock. Welcome. It's kind of hard to fake this visually with just the colossus legs, and probably I will still do some tweaks with that to make it feel more natural. Uh, but I will, for now, just leave it at that. Um, there are a lot of more trees here, so you can still go here to the cliff. But uh, you will also see some some trees already. I had to remove the huts because uh, this colossal thing was just too huge. There's still another way down here where some people are fishing. So the fishing hole still stayed. And Tain Octavius probably wants to dive because, like, look at him. But yeah. So this is the version 1.0 of the Forest of the Cliff hideout. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. If you don't, then please feel free to just keep... an a lower version of that. I will probably also do that 
at some point in the future and try different things out. We'll go back to version 0 0.6, like with all this, this bridge Colossus thing going on and try some other things, or I will probably go over here and build something to the right. I still don't know, but it's still evolved. So yeah, enjoy and like it. <laughs> like in the Hydro Show case, it was actually the the hottest hideout last month. And thanks for that. Thanks for the favorites. That's 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 really making me happy, because I put uh, a lot of effort and a lot of time in into building this hideout. And yeah, I just I just like to see that people, some people enjoy it. So thank you for that, and goodbye.